leaking fixtures all over the place. King the legal downspout. Leaking ball well. Coming all the way from the top. Or rusting everything up. You know the heat exchanger is uh, defective. Undersized expansion tank. Design called for 13, 15 G, uh, gallons. This one is a 4.5 gallon one. Missing a quick setter flow control valve instead of a cheap gate valve is installed. Cracked, leaking adapter on an absolutely unnecessary faucet. Leaking humidifier line, quarter inch. Another duty. Mayor went absolutely unneeded on a stick, it was leaking prior. So the work commences. As you can see, there is already calcium buildup on a brand new igniter. There is water on the inside of the heat exchanger lid and looking inside the heat exchanger we can see oops steam coming through oh, that's where the leak is peeing right inside. So the top is removed, the supply and the return unions are removed, uh, gasket goes with the other one but we have spares. The sensors removed from the top and the bottom before the unions, obviously. But now some bolts holding the heat exchanger in the back. Once that is removed, one bolt if I see it correctly. And this guy should be coming out in one piece. Of course there was no drain left on the bottom. So we could easily drain the heat exchanger, save uh, $20. So we had to remove the pump to drain the heat exchanger. The vent is fixed. So heat exchanger coming out. Because the tank was undersized, the bladder inside has burst and now the tank is useless. It's not absorbing any water It's uh, because uh, the air is out and it's filled up with five gallons of water. So because it was undersized, it was destroyed. Because it was destroyed, it couldn't absorb the expanding water. The expanding water then went and damage the heat exchanger because it could not drain out because of the kinged uh, flexible hose that was attached to it to go to the drain. So this hose here that's on the ground now, <laughs> this was attached to the uh, pressure relief valve but it was kinged so it couldn't relieve uh, the pressure. The pressure built up and destroyed the old heat, heat exchanger. All the rotten water that filled the tank is coming out because the bladder burst and it stinks bad.
more leaks. Put in the down spot. And the top. Well, off to the hair skew. 13 gallon expansion tank. And it fits. Looks like it's okay. Working. Remove the fuseless hose bib, fix all the leaks, 